Turn around. Time up. Hold it, Ryder. Take this money to handle and meet you later. Right. crazy about it myself. But folks just can't stand by and do nothing while their neighbors starve. Besides, those fellows got all the ready cash there was in the counter. I'm ready. Come on, Red. We'll be back in a couple of hours. All right. Don't worry, Beth. I won't. to have to mortgage such splendid property as the circle our ranch. Sure it is. But those ranchers who were burned out have to have money to get going again. I wish you could have given her a little more time on that loan, Mr. Gregg. I'm sorry. It's rather a large loan, and 30 days is all that we can allow. Well, that's all right. I'll have a herd ready for market in two or three weeks. Well, good day, Mr. Drake. Good day, Duchess. managed to get a mortgage in the Circle R, that biggest spread in the county. As soon as it's known the Western Pacific Railroad is going to build through here, that ranch alone will be worth a fortune. What chance will the Duchess have of being able to pay off this mortgage on time? That's where you come in. All we have to do is stop them from getting the cattle ready in time for the fall shipment. They have plenty of feed, but the water supply is limited. 
Yeah, now let me show you. Here's Coyote Creek. Uh -huh. Waterhole in Sand Canyon. Over here is the big tank in the north pasture. Yeah. You'll need six men. Have two of them go to Coyote Creek? Signal. That's Little Beaver's signal. He must be in trouble. Come on. Cherokee. That's what I've got to ask little Beaver. Now, Sprout, what's this all about? Me fix them so they don't get away. Me tie saddles to tree. Horses go. Saddles stop. Quick. What have these fellas done? They put plenty poison in creek. So that's it. Is the rest of your gang pulling this gun on the other water holes, too? You'll find out. I aim to. Cherokee, you take these two hombres back to the ranch and send somebody out here to guard the creek. All right. Little Beaver, you stay here and keep the stock out of the water until the guards get here. I'm going to go take a look at the other water holes. Oh. We'll meet you at the border crossing. The 
sure spoil this water hole. After Gus and Bart finish off the big tank, the circle our cattle is sure gonna get thirsty. Cut your off. Put them up. Take your guns out. Easy like. Toss them away. We'll burn in a hurry. Let's throw on the oil. Get the torch ready.
morning, folks. Good morning, Cherokee. Good morning, Cherokee. Red, we're in a jackpot with our water supply all shot up. We sure are, Cherokee. Unless we can patch up our pumps till we get a new one from Kansas City. Yeah, but that beef herd out on the flat needs water bad right now. We got to do something about that, Red. If we can't market that beef herd in good shape, I won't be able to take up that mortgage Drake holds on the Circle R. I know that, Duchess. The best thing we can do is throw him onto Wilson's range. He's got water. Cherokee, you get the herd headed toward the Lazy W. It'll take you time to get through Sundown Pass because it's so narrow. Yeah. Beth, you go over to Wilson's this afternoon and tell him we're throwing our herd onto his water in the morning. Why not right away? He'll be busy with his own shores. Catch him when things slack up. Duchess, I'm going in the mesquite. All right. Where do you think you're going, Sprout? Little Beaver, go with Red Ryder. Yeah? Why? Might be trouble. <laughs> well, it might be at that. Come on. Circle our beef herd. Where? Looks like they're heading for Sundown Pass. Sundown Pass? Hmm. Can you get a message through to one eye for me? Sure. Good. Wait here. Beef herd toward Sundown Pass. Sundown Pass? That means that he's on his way to use the water hole in Wilson's Ranch. That's just the way I had it figured. Last Sundown Pass full of rocks. With the pass blocked, it'll take two weeks to get a trail herd to Wilson's Lazy W. If we can foreclose in the Circle R before the railroad builds through here, the smaller ranches will be a cinch to handle. Well, let one eye handle this. Early. I need some parts for my water pump. I hope you've got them. Pump breakdown? No. The same outfit that's been shooting the ranchers off their spreads got to my water supply last night. Things ain't right around here, Red. Somebody's out to do you fellas in. We know that. But our turn will come. Let's take a look at those parts. Little Beaver pays for apples. for Sundown Pass, as soon as they get the powder. That pass is so narrow, you could blow it up with a 45. Now, wait a minute. I'm going to get me an apple. By the time the Circle R gets their cattle moving, my job at the pass ought to be finished. 
Yeah, mighty smart of the boss to figure to block that path by blowing her up. And that's one spot that Red won't be able to wrangle himself out of. That little beaver. Maybe you heard Come on. Gun barrels. That'll keep him quiet. Now, this ain't no place to do it. Oh, we'll hold him in the barn till after dark. I'll send those parts up to you just as soon as they get in. Thanks, Johnson. I wonder what's happened to Little Beaver. <laughs> Looks like he got his apple. <laughs> he wouldn't go off and leave a mess like that. And he's left his pony. Look, Red. Something's happened to him, sure enough. Come on, fella. You're gonna help me find our pal. I'm going down. What happened this time? Little Beaver fell an apple barrel. Hear men talk. What about? Get on my back. Yeah, maybe it would be safer if one of the hands went along. Don't worry, Duchess. I can take care of myself. All right, now tell me what you heard. I want to blow up quick. Feel sun down past with rock. I gotta stop that. You go back to the ranch and tell Cherokee to hold the cattle.
You all right? I'm all right. What happened? Somebody blew the top off this cliff to block the path. How can we get the cattle through to Wilson's now? We can't. We've got to take them somewhere else. Come on, let's get out of here. Plenty drinks. Blasting Sundown Pass hasn't stopped Ryder. He's made a deal with Madison for water rights on the Bar M. The Bar M? Yes, and if they market that herd, the Duchess will be able to pay off your mortgage. Oh, no, she won't. The Western Pacific will pay a fortune for the Circle R Ranch. And I've got to get title to it before she finds out that the railroad is going to build through here. Fortunately, I hold a mortgage on the Bar M. And Madison is way behind in his payment. I'll go see Madison. Good. Hi, Madison. Quite a stranger. What are you doing up this way? Want to have a little talk with you. Don't you sit down? Thanks. I, uh... I don't want to hurry you, Madison, but, uh, this new territorial banking commission won't let me carry delinquent accounts. Unless you pay up in three days, my bank will have to take over. Well, dang it, you can't do that. Well, I've slaved to make this a paying ranch, and just when I begin to see light... Now, it isn't my fault. Well, maybe it ain't. What am I going to do? I can't raise half that much money in three days' time. I know what I'd do. Circle R is using your wells, isn't it? Yes. Make them pay you now for the water rights. That would give you enough money to meet your payment. Oh, I can't do that. Red and the Duchess are just as hard up for cash as I am. Maybe they could raise the money. Maybe they can. But I don't want to push them. Don't seem neighborly. Well, think it over. You know, it's better to collect the money that's due you and save your ranch and be a good neighbor and lose it. Besides, if the bank did take over the bar, M, I'd have to make them pay in advance for pasture anyway. You would? Yes. Banking commission rules. Well, in that case, I'll go see Red today. Wish you luck. Let me know how you make out. I'll do that. That's how it stands, Red. Craig said he'd help us out if he could. But his hands are tied. Well, I know the Duchess doesn't have the money. And Drake has a mortgage on the Circle R already. She just can't raise the cash. Hmm. Unless maybe I sell the cattle. And I'd hate to do that now because they're not ready for market yet. I don't want you to do that. You'd only get half what they're worth. Yeah, I know it. Little Beaver needs clarity, quick. Don't bother us now, Sprout. We're busy. Little Beaver busy, too. Got big news. What do you got? Maybe this is it. A thousand dollar prize. If I could grab that off, our troubles would be over. Red Rider go and race? You bet I will. I'm going downtown to sign up right now. Red's got a chance for that thousand, all right. Hello, folks. We're all bidding on you, Red. Red's got the best chance to win, all right. No, he hasn't, because we can't afford to let him. Good luck. Thanks, Brown. I'm going to need a little good luck. <laughs> There's much, much more than that thousand dollars at stake on this deal. How are you going to stop him? That's your job. In the morning, before the race starts, you ride out to the Circle R. You're not doing any racing today. Tell the boss I got him. 
Well? One I second read to the old land by the shack over Dark Canyon. Well, why didn't you cut him out of the play for good? Now get going and take care of him. Slim's driving out with a load of grub. You can ride with him. Red Rider cut up in the shack, and the boy wants him taken care of. Come along. Just a little drink to celebrate the stagecoach race. You ain't gonna win. Somebody's waylaid red or he'd be here. Two minutes! Cherokee, where are you going? I'm gonna drive that stage. Slade will be watching if you need any help. Go on. right now. Keep them covered. Oh, pretty smart, ain't you? Get up. All right, you got your hands loose. Now you can use them. Grave digging to do. You dig it, we'll fill it. Get going.
down from there, Sprout. I got a lot of writing to do. You go on back to the ranch and stay out of trouble. 